Members of the Jewish community in Crown Heights marched to the 71st Precinct demanding two of its officers be fired. They're outraged over the treatment and arrest of Ehud Haleve. Video captured one of the officers, Louis Vega, putting up his fist and punching the 21-year-old several times inside a youth center. Fire them now! Stop police brutality! Fire them now! Police say they were called to the center by the security guard who said Haleve was sleeping naked. By the time police arrived, they said he had on pants. The criminal complaint says officers were told the man was sleeping in a section designated for women. But the center's rabbi says there's no such section and the 21-year-old was allowed to be there. 5 a.m. is not a women's side. 5 a.m. It is, it is a lounge, or a place for people who need a place to sleep to crash for the night. The 21-year-old was not here at this rally. His lawyers say it wouldn't be wise for him to show up because he's still facing very serious charges, including resisting arrest and assaulting police officers. The arrest was for trespass, and he wasn't trespassing. You can't be resisting arrest. They say the video doesn't show the man hitting police. They're urging the Brooklyn DA to drop all the charges. Internal Affairs is looking into the incident. It's, it's disturbing, and uh, we are doing an investigation. The officer has been placed on modified assignment. Elected officials say most officers are doing a good job, but this case shows that some abuse their power. Thinking that he was getting into a boxing ring, literally lining himself up, lining up the victim, right. and then, right. you know, it was, it was just unbelievable. That picture is in my head. So it doesn't matter if a young person is wearing a yarmulke, or Yankee baseball cap. Police need to treat them with dignity and respect. Yeah. The Civilian Complaint Review Board is also investigating. In Brooklyn, Dean Memminger, New York One.